James Wanda is James the Wine Guy, a fantastic, gorgeous wine coming from Georgia. It is a uh, blend of Arcazzatelli and Mitsubani. Stay tuned for this review. So when I look at Georgian wines, it has had a tremendously long history, and yet I am finding the wine so compelling, so beautiful, and uh, I think it's a region that I'm tasting wines that I think are just phenomenal, and I think they are getting better and better. So, uh, you know, when you look at Cavevery, very large vessels placed in the earth, and uh, that's where the wines become even more delightful over time. So let me introduce this wine, put a little more of my wine glass. I always use a burgundy glass for tasting most wines, probably a good 90% of them. So this wine is called Shumai, that's a producer, and uh, this particular bottling is known as Tisnandali, and it's a Georgian white dry wine and 2014 vintage, 12.5% ABV, superbly low in alcohol content. Look at the back label here, it's so cool. And uh, look at the Georgian script on top. This wine is 85% Arcatitelli, 15% Mitsuvani. So this wine I like to compare to in many ways to a Pinot Blanc, which I think is fantastic. Uh, fallen in love with Pinot Blancs in the past few years. And uh, so this is reminiscent too. So as I do in my wine reviews, I never put down one wine uh, variety against another. I think they're really great. Uh, uh, you know, wines being produced. I think all varieties, um, you know, 99% of them I'm absolutely adoring. But uh, for me, this is an absolutely gorgeous representation of the Republic of Georgia wines and uh, tradition. And so I also think of Pinot Blanc and Pinot Noir and Pinot Gris uh, basically stemming from Pinot Noir. And uh, when you look at Pinot Noir, it's one of the oldest grape varieties around. And I could probably say the same for the Arcades Italian and the Mitzvani. It is really that ancient heritage. And so what you have is you have a definitive wine where, you know, I think it has an homage to being as close to Vitis Silvestris as possible. I don't know a lot about Arcats Italian. I'm not sure that anyone does, or the Mitzvani grape as well, is that it's a very ancient grape. Uh, but first, the point score on this. This is a superb wine, 94 points out of 100 points. It is a wine that I think is really spectacular. So in this, I'm getting notes of uh, moist stones, green, yellow citrus zest, quince, and passion fruit. Next is a flavor characterization, and I'll repeat the point score once again. So very much like a Pinot Blanc wine. And again, I'm never gonna put down Pinot Blanc because I love it, uh, but really gorgeous minerality to this wine. Leanness and yet assuringly generous at the same time. Uh, notes on this wine include passion fruit, white peach, lime zest, white floral tones as well. Again, 94 points out of 100 points. Seek this wine out. I'll put more information on the import down below. So what's down below? The like button. And also you can leave your questions and comments there as well. And also you can do that on the variety of social medias that I'm on, such as Facebook, Twitter, Google+, Pinterest, LinkedIn, as well as Instagram and WordPress. So my goal in that racetrack is to taste wine from all points on the planet, as well as all varieties. So thank you again for watching today. Stay tuned for more. Salud.